Let me explain. Getting married is like a sprint. From the moment you decide you're the one, you're the one, we're spending our life together, oh my God, from there, it's a sprint to the finish line of the party, the wedding, whatever, right? It's you, it's you, oh my God, yay! And then you have the party or the wedding and people are throwing rice on you or you're going on a fire for seven days, whatever your deal is. It's amazing, yay! That's a sprint. When you finish the sprint, everyone leaves, you and your partner holding hands, so excited. You look over there, you say, what's that? Huh, is that a marathon track? Yes, and that is called staying married. <laughs> this is getting married, that is staying married round and round and round and round. <laughs> the same track with the same person, and if you're doing it properly, it's forever. <laughs> Which was fine when they invented all these ideas because we all died at 34. <laughs> and now it's more than double. How do people look when they finish a sprint? You've watched so many races. People finishing a sprint are always pumped, yes? Always, they're like, mmm, ha, ha. How do people look when they are finishing a marathon? <laughs> the fundamental thing to notice about people finishing a marathon is they don't know how they are feeling themselves, <laughs> right? They come to that finish line, they're like, <laughs> Some of these people are being taken to the corner and being wrapped in tin foil. <laughs> and others are running with the nipples are bleeding. What is this? And some of these people on the marathon have stopped in front of 10,000 spectators to take a shit. <laughs> Honestly, no self-respect left whatsoever. Just trying to get to the end somehow.